Hi guys, welcome back to a new video. In this video we are going to be looking at the top 5 guns in season 8. Let's get into it. The DRH has been one of the best guns in the game for a while as it has the 3 shot capabilities but unfortunately will get outclassed by other guns because of the slow fire rate, which is why this season it only gets an honorable mention. The next honorable mention is the RPD. This gun has low recoil and a high time to kill at medium to long range which means that it will beam at medium to long range. However, because of the slow ADS time and lower fire rate it won't hold up at close range. At the number 5 spot we have two guns. These are the CR-56 Amax and the SKS which both play the same. They are both a two shot kill at most ranges which makes it very good at medium to long range. But because of the slow fire rate it will get outclassed by most guns at close. They also both will one shot headshot which would make it beam at long range. In at the number 4 spot we have the PP19 Bison. This gun takes the number 4 spot because it is highly versatile as it has a large magazine size and low recoil. This makes it good for new players as it is easy to use. It will get outclassed at all ranges which is why it isn't higher on the list. The last honorable mentions is the Locus and Day LQ33. The gotta hit flinch buff which makes it a lot easier to use but because of the slow fire rate and slow adds time it will get outclassed by most guns. But at long range they are some of the best guns in the game. This lack of versatility means that they will only get an honorable mention instead of being on the top 5. In at the number 3 spot we have the AS Val. This gun has a high fire rate and decent damage which means that it will shred at close to medium range. However because of the high recoil and the fact that this gun has bullet velocity, it means that it won't do so well at long range. Because the AS Val gets outclassed by the next gun on the list, it isn't high on the list. In at the number 2 spot we have the King of Close Range, the MX-9. This gun will decimate at close to medium range because of the high fire rate of decent damage, and with the large caliber ammo, it will become a 3 shot kill, if you hit one headshot. However because of the high recoil and damage drop off it doesn't do so well at long range. At the number 1 spot we have the Holger. This gun has been to the top since it got released. It is one of the most versatile guns with a no stop attachment, significantly increasing the mobility of the gun. It will laser at medium to long range, and can hold up at close range, although can get outclassed by MX-9 at close range. This will be the end of the video here. If you enjoy the video then make sure to like and subscribe and turn on post notifications to stay up to date with all of my future videos. Bye.